Welcome back to our channel. We have another travel vlog for you today. It has been back to back trips for us. Yeah, we only had one day in between, so we got yeah. home and then right quick turnaround back on the road. Yeah. And we just headed up the Coquihalla through Kelowna and now we're on to our next destination, which is Vernon. And we're super excited. So, very excited to go to Silver Star, which is one of the only mountains that's open this week. Everything is closing down for the season. Um, and they extended their season by one week so we are yeah. going on the second to last day um, to get some more skiing in so we're very excited about that and we're staying in Vernon for like five days and just exploring we had Theo with us and we're gonna do a bunch of dog friendly activities check out the town and bring you along so we're very excited yeah let's go just arrived in Vernon. Well, we're a little bit outside. We're actually still in Vernon, but we're about 20 minutes. Thank you, Theo. <laughs> we're about 20 minutes from the downtown area of Vernon, and we drove a beautiful drive along the lake here to get to our place that we're staying. <laughs> it's so beautiful. We are right on the lake, so it's called the Outback Lakeside Vacation Homes. Um, it's so gorgeous. The sun is going down right now over the lake and it's just beautiful. We'll show you the view in a second. Like the snowy mountains yeah. and the lake. Oh, gorgeous. It's so pretty and it's just like really quiet and really like private here. Yeah. Um, so there are a bunch of private villas. We're staying in a two bedroom villa. There is so much space. We could absolutely have, you know, a few more people here, yeah. another couple, do a big family trip. There's so much room here. It's great. Um, I think Theo is going to be very happy. I think so too. The living room overlooks the water, the lake, and we've got a little telescope here, so maybe we can spot some wildlife. Ogopogo? <laughs> oh, maybe the Ogopogo, yeah. Ogopogo watch. Does anyone know what Ogopogo is? I don't know. We'll see. Tell us in the comments if you know what Ogopogo yeah. is. And then, of course, can't forget about the two decks. There's a deck on the main level here, and there's also a balcony up top, which will be beautiful for watching sunsets in the evenings and maybe a little morning coffee in yeah. the morning. Yeah, sounds nice. And from this lower balcony, you can see the little hot tub, which maybe we're going to go hop in soon. And the beach down there, and too. There's also, yeah, there's a little beach that we can walk down, which I think we're going to do that now because Theo's very antsy to go see what's going on. Um, and yeah, go check out the lake and walk around a bit. It's so nice here. I'm really excited to be staying outside of the town just to have this like access to nature and the beautiful views. But we're still really close by. Um, so we'll be driving into town a lot to do some stuff as well. So. Yeah. Very excited to be here. Yeah. It's so pretty. Let's get started. Yeah. sleep last night it was we so did. quiet yeah yeah we're used to the city so anytime we're out you know in nature it's really it's nice so and relaxing. peaceful and we kind of remember that yeah it's really nice <laughs> <laughs> yeah we had a very good sleep which I feel like we needed because we've been go 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 yeah um and then yeah had a slow morning and now we're taking Theo for a little walk there's a nearby trail that takes you down to a little beach yeah um and it's a beautiful day the sun is out so yeah, yeah. We're over at Ellison Provincial Park and we are going to walk down to the beach. So Theo will be really excited about that. Yeah. There are campgrounds here at the park and there's also a day use area. So we came by to have a little hike around and uh, explore the area.
lovely day so far. Beautiful weather, beautiful little beach and trail, and it was just so nice to be out in the fresh air. And yeah, I think yeah. everyone enjoyed it. Theo enjoyed it. I think he did. And now we are just driving into town. We're going to grab some lunch, um, check out the town a little bit, and then head back to our place, drop Theo, and then we have a couple exciting activities later on that he can't come to. Yeah. Sad. He won't um, rub it in. Yeah. <laughs> Should be fun for us. So, yeah, let's go grab some food. lovely whiskey tasting and a nice dinner and um, Katie's driving because I had more whiskey at the whiskey tasting than she did. Yeah I'm not usually much to help. Um, well it was a tasting too. I even asked like are you supposed to like drink all of these because I thought you just sip them. He's like no most people drink it all. So I'm like, okay I won't be doing that. Yeah. Um, but it was But the whiskey fun. was delicious. It was very good. Yeah. And his dinner was amazing as well. Um, it's been a really good day. Yeah. So we are headed back to our awesome villa and we're gonna go be reunited with Theo and then try to get an early night's sleep because we've got early morning on the mountain tomorrow at Silver Star and another big ski day which yep. is awesome and I'm super excited about that. I'm excited too. Probably our last big ski day of the season um, and I'm just excited to go on a new mountain and check it out and conditions should be good I think so hopefully it'll be a good day. Yeah. All right, let's go home. Good morning, it is bright and early and we just got to the mountain. Yeah, we um, got up early and we dropped Theo with a sitter in town. And we're up here on the mountain and it's like nice and warm and sunny yeah. and it's gonna be a proper spring ski day. Yeah, I think it's gonna be really nice. We're gonna spend the day here ski do lunch hang out i think there are gonna be some like festivities in the little village because it's the closing weekend yeah so it should be really fun let's go let's go Well, it's our last full day in Verdon. We've been having such a great time. Yesterday was a really fun time up at Silver Star, yeah. and today we're back in town. Yeah, so today we've traded our ski helmets for bike helmets, and <laughs> we are doing a bike ride along the Okanagan Rail Trail, which is absolutely beautiful. We it stopped is. here at a little beach partway up, maybe like seven, mile, seven miles, seven kilometers. <laughs> where are we? Canada? Yeah, seven kilometers. Seven kilometers. Um, away from the Coldstream area where we started. And uh, we have bike rentals from Calavita, which is a little surf shop on the lake. Super cute. Yeah. And Theo's loving it. He's yeah. been in his backpack enjoying the free ride. <laughs> I'm not working that hard either because we have e-bikes, which is awesome. Yeah, they've been really nice. They're like the pedal assist. So yeah, this is our first time doing e-bikes, but it's been great. Theo's having a great time. And yeah, the views are beautiful. <laughs> the whole trail goes along the lake yeah. um, and it's gorgeous. There's tons of people out walking and cycling and it's, yeah, it's a really good spot. Yeah, so we're going to stop for a little snack break and then keep going. Yeah.
we've had a, such a good day. <laughs> Theo thinks so too. He's, He's had, had a, a great day. day. Oh, thank you. Even though it rained, we still had such a great time. We managed to uh, finish our bike ride just before it started pouring rain, so that yeah. was perfect timing. Yeah. No, it's been such a nice day. Bike ride was so fun. I think Theo really enjoyed it. Yeah. And then, yeah, we got some more time to kind of just explore around town. Um, and then we got back to our place and hopped in the hot tub in the rain, yeah. which was really nice. Yeah, perfect place to be in the rain is the hot tub. Yeah. And um, the view is still really clear, so it was kind of perfect. We had the yeah. rain coming down, and we still got the view. What a nice way to kind of end off our time here. Yeah, it's our last night, and it's just been such a fun weekend, such a fun few days. We've done a lot. Um, and yeah, we're just going to relax tonight in the villa and then take off in the morning. So. Yeah. yeah. So that's it for our time in Vernon. Thank you so much for following along. We had such a great time here. Hopefully you had a great time <laughs> watching what we got up to. And hopefully you get a chance to come here yourself. Yeah, we'll leave all of our recommendations in the description below. So you have all the names of the businesses and everywhere we went. Yeah. Um, everything we yeah definitely recommend. So if you're planning a trip here, be sure to check that out. Yeah. All right, we'll see you next time. Bye.